story time with Grand Grands. Well, today we're going to be, what? Yeah, look, here, okay? Ooh. Yes, I know it's a bit difficult for you to see, but we're doing it for everybody. Pooh Bear, Molly, and Big Ted. Thank you for inviting me. I was a bit lonely upstairs. I'm so old. Yes, we know, now just listen. I want to see the moon. This book was Hannah's favourite. I want to see the moon. Lots of lovely clouds. Oh, I like this book. Can I turn? No, you can't turn the pages. Grand Ben's job. Toby woke up in the middle of the night. Daddy! He called. Daddy! Footsteps came up the stairs. Clump, 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 clump. Hello, Toby, said Daddy, as he lifted Toby in his arms. I want to see the moon, said Toby. Would you like to make a pee first, asked Daddy. Yes, said Toby. Ooh, is he going to use the toilet or the potty? I don't know, we'll just have to wait and see, Pooh. Just wait a minute, okay? Oh, I'm very keen to see what he does. Yes, I know, just everybody calm down, okay? They went to the bathroom. I want to see the moon, said Toby. Oh, look, what's he? Oh, look, his big boy sitting on the toilet. That's a clever boy, Toby. Well done, good job. <gasps> now, let's put on a clean nappy, said Daddy. I want to see the moon, said Toby. Oh, look, he's got a nice teddy bear, hasn't he? That's nice. He's like us. Yes, he is. Daddy filled a glass of water for Toby. I want to see the moon, said Toby. Let's go downstairs for a little while, said Daddy. I'll give you a piggyback. I want to see the moon, said Toby. Oh, it's very exciting. Does he get to see the moon? Well, we'll just wait and see. Quite frankly, some of us are getting a little bit annoyed and want him to say please and go back to bed, but never mind. In front of the fire was Toby's favourite book, still open where he had left it and not tidied it away. Let's read a story, said Daddy. I want to see the moon, said Toby. Under the kitchen table were Toby's building bricks, just where he had also left them. He hadn't done his tidy up very well. Let's build a castle, said Daddy, a big castle with chimneys and windows and turrets and things. I want to see the moon, said, to said Toby. Well, I don't know about you, but I think his mummy would have had something to say about that. Maybe, let's go back to bed. Do you know what I've got for you, said Daddy? A lovely mug of warm milk. I don't want a lovely mug of warm milk, said Toby. I know what you want, said Daddy. You want to see the moon. Yes, please, I want to see the moon, said Toby. Oh, that's very exciting. Is this where he gets to see the moon? Well, let's just see. You never know. Shush, now sit down, Molly. So they went outside into the garden to look at the moon. Oh, oh no, but the moon wasn't there. There was nothing in the sky but big black clouds. Oh no, that's so sad. Yes, I know, Big Ted. It is a bit sad, isn't it? All that time, no moon. <gasps> but a little wind was blowing. <sighs> it was blowing the big black clouds across the sky. <sighs> Everyone wants them to blow together. Help. <sighs> oh, good job, guys. Every now and then, a little light from the moon shone through. The moon was playing hide and seek behind the clouds. <gasps> Where's the moon, Daddy? asked Toby. Shh, said Daddy, possibly a little more firmly than he meant. If we wait here a little while and watch very closely, the wind will blow the clouds across the sky until the moon breaks through the clouds and... There's the moon, said Toby. Oh, it's a beautiful moon, said Daddy. Beautiful moon, said Toby. Good night.
night, Moon, said Toby. Oh, and then Daddy carried him back up the stairs to bed, carrying his teddy. There, night, night, Toby. And let's hope he goes to sleep now and stays there. What do you think? Well, I think he'll go to sleep now. Do you? I hope so. Now it's in the middle. Yes, me too. I think he's going to go to sleep like a good boy. Well, good. That's the end then. There.